Now it's time to test the adaptive cruise control feature, which means I press this button to activate the adaptive cruise control. I increase the speed. I will keep it at maybe 80 kilometers per hour. There's a car right ahead of us. And okay, it's a little slow to move because it increases by one kilometers per hour at a time. Actually, I've increased it to almost 100 kilometers per hour. Now, if you notice one thing, I don't have to do anything. I have left the steering wheel and the speed is automatically decreasing because it senses there's a car right ahead. You can see, I am not touching the accelerator or the brakes. Now it's accelerating again. We just going to follow that car and be at the same speed as the car ahead. Now, if I decide to move in a clear path, there it automatically increases speed and reach 100 km per hour very smoothly. Let's get into the line of sight of that car ahead and there automatically it starts applying brakes. Talking about brakes, there is this B mode, brake mode, okay, which is regenerative braking using the paddles. I can decide. Now it's on maximum. When I put it on maximum, it is automatically going to decrease the speed of the car and it's actually going to start crawling at 6 to 7 kilometers per hour. Look at me. No brakes applied. That is regenerative braking, putting energy back into the battery pack.